Asset Protect is a single pane of glass over all asset security solutions deployed in the network, and it controls endpoint prevention, detection, and response layers across all platforms, covering desktops, servers, agentless virtual machines, and even managed mobile devices. Thanks to its agent based architecture, Asset Protect can do more than just remotely manage asset security products. As an MSP, you can take advantage of Asset Protect capabilities to run scripts, run remote commands, apply operating system updates, install or uninstall applications, collect logs, list installed software, and get the hardware configuration on client computers. The following examples demonstrate the capabilities of Asset Protect in advanced management on the client computers of your customers. After logging into the web console, we can see one alert on Red PC in Colors customer group. It seems that Windows operating system is not updated on this computer. Management of operating system updates is one of the capabilities of Asset Protect. Therefore, we can create a new client task targeted to dynamic group computers with outdated operating system. The task type is operating system update. In settings, we can define the parameters of this task. Now let's check the execution status of this client task. After several minutes, the task of OS update is successfully finished on the client computer. As a result, the respective dynamic group is empty and there are no alerts on Red PC. In the following part, we will demonstrate how to remotely enable connection via remote desktop. In this case, we will remotely run command on client computer Blue PC that modifies the respective registry key. To achieve this, we will create a new client task targeted to Blue PC. The task type is Run Command. In Settings section, type the command line to run. After a successful task execution, we can verify that RDP connection is enabled on Blue PC. From now on, the administrator can establish RDP connection to client computer directly from Web Console. This way you can run any batch script or for instance PowerShell script. One of the very useful EM agent features is its ability to collect information on installed applications on the client computer. The list of installed applications can be found in the computer details. By default, the EM agent is reporting asset applications only. To report also non-asset applications, we added the existing general agent policy and in advanced settings enable reporting of non-asset installed applications. As a result, the list contains all installed applications on the client computer. EM agent is also able to uninstall software on client computers. We will demonstrate this on uninstallation of Adobe Acrobat Reader application. Select the application from the list and press the Uninstall button. In a moment, the respective application is uninstalled from the target computer. Back in the web console, we can see that Acrobat Reader is not in the list of installed applications anymore. And in the same way as the EM agent is able to collect information on installed software, it's also able to obtain very detailed information on hardware configuration on the client computer. You can find it in computer details as well. Note that the software and hardware inventory is not just a list of static data, but it can be used in rules of dynamic group templates as well as data points in report templates. In this video we have picked only a few examples that might be useful for MSPs. For some of these you may need slightly advanced scripting skills, but we believe that for you as an MSP professional it's all going to be a piece of cake. In case you need more information, please visit our online help and knowledge base.